Hello. So many of you have written to me asking me to show you fountain pens instead of telling, you know, lengthy stories or having interviews which you have liked. But uh, if you want to know about your fountain pens, you want to know, uh, you want to see the pens, you want to know the fountain pens. So what I did <clears throat> was uh, I've ordered a couple of fountain pens that I want to uh, share with you today. Uh, these we'll talk about this one later on uh, but we will talk about these two pens and uh, this is a very interesting story before I show you the actual pens let me tell you the story like uh, like most fountain pen lovers in India my first hand turned India made uh, ebonite pen was a Noka from ASA Pens. Uh, friends, so I have got a ASA Nauka for you today. It's an ebonite pen. It's a hand-turned pen. It comes with a Jovo nib and it is a 3-in-1 pen which uh, uh, has a cartridge converter system. It can also be used as an eyedropper filler. But uh, this is the pen, I mean, uh, this is one of the most popular pens in India and this has a very interesting story behind it. So we are going to talk about this story to you today. I've got two of them in fact, I'm, uh, so I'll, I'll primarily be showing you these two pens, this one and uh, this one. So. Uh, like I was saying, my first hand turn Devonite India made pen was uh, Asa uh, Noka. And it was much later that I realized that uh, Subramaniam, uh, aka Subbu, aka Anna, who is a very popular figure in this fountain pen community, was actually or is actually a childhood friend. We have literally grown up together. Uh, he was here in Calcutta, uh, he did his, uh, uh, I mean, he studied in the Bhavanipur education, though I am from St. Xavier's, but uh, we knew each other as kids uh, when we were school going kids and uh, he speaks excellent Bengali as you all know and uh, before he shifted uh, to Chennai, he was here in Calcutta and uh, from what I learned, he picked up his love for fountain pens here in Calcutta. Uh, well, am I biased about uh, ASA pens? Am I biased about Subramaniam? Well, yes, I am. Not because uh, he's a friend of mine, but because these are excellent pens. I mean, anyone who has used them will vouch for it. And uh, these are excellent pens and I am biased. So, uh, but now more about uh, the Nauka pens. The Nauka was inspired by an old win classic uh, with obvious, uh, some obvious design tinkerings. And guess what? These designs were completely outsourced in WhatsApp uh, with Prithij, three uh, people, Prithijit Chaki, Hari Balakrishna, and Bob G of FPN doing the honors. These are the guys who had, uh, you know, uh, done the original designing of these pens. And it was Bob G who had named these pens Noka based on the Indian boat, uh, which uh, uh, we all feel uh, the pen uh, resembles. Now, the Noka is a classic case. The Noka is a classic case of design rediscovery, of uh, reinvention, if you may. And uh, if you were to look at it, it's about uh, online collaboration and social media interaction in the most positive sense. This is what can be done by fountain pen lovers if they unite together for a greater cause. So, um, I mean, instead of bitching about each other and about each other's collections, if uh, they, if fountain pen lovers like us, if we collaborate, if we work together, this is what we can achieve. 
and uh, I mean this is an example of the sheer love of it all. Uh, you know this is a simply elegant pen. This is so elegant with a streamlined body and the barrel integrating seamlessly uh, into the section. So this is uh, this is what makes it uh, uh, really beautiful. And uh, this is, like I was saying, a hand-turned pen. It comes in uh, ebonite and in acrylic. It uh, sports a German Jovo nib unit and a Schmid uh, K5 converter. It can also be used as an eyedropper, make, uh, making it a three-in-one filler. Uh, the Nuka, incidentally, is perhaps the most customized pen uh, in India because though these are the classic designs, uh, I've heard so many people request Subramaniam to, you know, uh, to uh, change the design, to tinker with it. And Subramaniam, the ever affable guy, he never says no to anyone. And he tries his best to have them customized for unique needs. I myself have uh, so many of these ASA pens in different uh, variations, in different avtas. Uh, and uh, what do I say? I'll, uh, I'll, 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 okay, what I'll do is I will ink one of these pens and uh, I will show you a writing sample. Like I was saying, this is a K5 converter. And we have, I, I will be taking in a very bright ink so that, uh, you know, uh, this, uh, you can see the color inside. And like uh, I was saying, this is, I'm inking this for the first time. You can see uh, how well the ASA works straight out of the box. This is, see, the ink uh, is full. The, you switch on the barrel and you can see the ink. Before I end, there is one thing that I want to share with the Fountain Pen Lovers community here or all uh, the viewers here. Uh, I want to say this from the bottom of my heart. Like, look, Subramaniam is a one-man army, you know, and uh, Quality pen turners are becoming as scarce as unicorn. You cannot just walk into a store and buy a hand-turned pen, uh, customized pen just off the shelf. Uh, because sourcing of parts too are extremely difficult these days. Customizing, I must repeat, is not the same as buying a pen off the shelf. You just cannot uh, buy a pen like this uh, off your pantaloons shop. So besides, pen turning is not a very profitable full-term business, uh, especially if you are working with uh, small exclusive hand turned pens especially if you are working in the price range in which uh, Asa and Subramaniam are uh, making their pens available to us. So what people like him uh, are actually doing is doing a great favor to the uh, fountain pen community by uh, providing us with uh, these uh, priceless pieces that we also love. So hold your guns if he's a bit late. Hold your guns because uh, please detest from uh, throwing invectives at him, at uh, making public castigations about writing nasty things in Facebook walls and uh, stuff like that, your pen will arrive. I mean, he's not running away or no one, none of these uh, people who are uh, pen turners or who are in the business will run away with your money. They, uh, they are trying their best. Sometimes the uh, materials are just not available. Sometimes most of, uh, if you uh, will see, this is German, this is German. 
only this part is Indian, uh, which is and uh, the craftsmanship is Indian. So, and uh, this uh, is also in all probability uh, imported. I don't know about this particular pen. So sometimes it's imported. Some they are also made in India, but. Uh, uh, these are good products. So what I'm trying to say is that it takes a long time. Sometimes these uh, imports uh, hit bottlenecks and uh, the materials are not available. The people who actually turn the pen are very difficult to come by because uh, and uh, they are overworked and they are not paid as much as you would normally pay uh, a craftsman in uh, Europe or America or any of the other countries. So uh, please bear with them and these guys are doing their best to bring their pens to us. So please bear with them when they are late. Uh, but uh, I guess that's it. Uh, they deserve, they deserve your love and affection more than uh, anything else. So but before I end uh, this uh, thing, I'll show you another pen that uh, Subramaniam has made for me. This is not a Nuka. I uh, uh, I wanted this pen. I wanted a red pen. I haven't had a haven't been writing with a red pen for a long time. So I requested, and uh, here he is. So this guy. And <laughs> let me tell you one more thing. This has taken a excruciatingly long time for this pen to arrive, but. Uh, I, 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 I uh, bore with him and uh, now that it's here, it's something that feels the bottom of my heart. So what else do I want? I, I guess I've paid for it and uh, I've waited for it. And sometimes sabar ka fal meetha hota hai. We are waiting. We are waiting for you to subscribe to our channel, to like this video, to share this video because we need a humongous amount of likes and subscribes to be considered by uh, YouTube. We are looking for your support. So please, uh, please support, please subscribe, please like the videos, please post your comments, please tell us how you would like us to make uh, more videos so that they become, uh, I mean, so that you get to like them. They get to answer the questions that are there in your heart. So thank you. Thank you again for watching this video. Thank you.